Jen, well, big, beautiful, full brows are all the rage right now, but women are paying big bucks for brow tinting, microblading, and even brow extensions. I've never heard of the extensions. I've well, heard of the others. What it says here is that there's an easier way <laughs> on this as seen on TV Tuesday. Amy Davis with the Bella Brow. We can't she's all tested have, it out. We can't all have brows like Owen. No. Right? Amen. Apparently that's <laughs> in right now. All natural. Very on fleek. <laughs> hey, okay, so we're talking about a $10 microblading eyebrow pen. It's not permanent, but it's supposed to give you the same wispy hair-like strokes as microblading, so it looks natural. I do my brows every day. Carrie Bond has light hair and light eyebrows. She wants a bolder look to help frame her face. I'm trying to keep the normal shape, but I also have like some sparse areas to them that I want to fill in and make sure they look full and defined. She's tried a lot of brow products. Right now, it's Cabral by Benefit. She paid $24 for it at Ulta. We asked her to do one brow with this and the other with the as seen on TV Bella brow that cost $10 at Walmart. First, Cabral. Bond describes it as a colored wax that goes on with this small brush. I find when I do that, it's not very even, so I use my own little spoolie to kind of brush it out. She says the Cabral sometimes flakes off on her face, taking even more time to clean it off. That's what I would like is something that's a little bit quicker and doesn't take so many steps. Bella Brow is up next. Okay, so Bella Brow's four-pronged precision applicator mimics the appearance of real hair for fuller, more natural-looking brows in seconds. I'm just going to make little tiny brush strokes. This is good. This product is more of a liquid, but it dries quickly. It took Bond a minute and three seconds to boost her brow with Bella Brow. She clocked in at a minute and 26 seconds with Cabral. And now for the big reveal. This is the work of Bella Brow. This is Cabral. What do you think? You have one on each. Which brow do you like better? You know, I think I like this one. Um, it's a little bit darker, but it was definitely easier for me to use, and it didn't take an extra step. That's a savings of 23 seconds and $14, making Bella Brow the better brow product for Bond. I give it a thumbs up. All right, so Bella Brow is also waterproof and smudge-proof. Bond did test that on her hand. She put a brush stroke on it and then tried to remove it with water. It didn't come off. But she said it did come off of her brows at the end of the day with her regular makeup remover. So Owen's taking notes. I know. Just make sure. <laughs> yeah, I should be going digital, but... <laughs> Yeah, that's okay. Look at those brows are so full. I mean, we've I all... from my grandpa. Oh, uh, natural. I wish mine were thicker, clearly. Ralph Owen thicker. had those brows. <laughs>